The rain began this afternoon and now we're gearing up for a second round to move through this evening, but it has already caused trouble for flyers. Take a look at this misery map by flight tracking website flight aware. The weather has delayed hundreds of flights coming in and out of our area today. Meteorologist Vanessa Murdoch here now with the red alert and how the rest of the night is expected to shape up. Vanessa. Well, I'm still chuckling a little bit at the misery map. I know that's not necessarily funny, but we can't take God credit for that. Listen, it is an unfortunate day. We do have one more quick moving round of rain that will move through, and then after that, it stays unfortunate damp and dreary and the winds will be picking up. This is actually a live picture. Well, it keeps going in and out. So we're going to move beyond this image right here. Damp and dreary right now, 55 degrees. Temperatures have been warming over the past few hours. As we look at the current satellite and radar picture, you can see just an array of shower activity around the region, but actually the heaviest activity is skirting us to the north right now. Here's that quick moving little line of rain that will lift through over the next couple of hours. And then after that, it's really just some spotty shower activity for us as this area of low pressure continues to lift off in the northeasterly direction. On the back edge of this system is a front that moves through tomorrow, bringing us a slim chance of an early shower. Other than that, it's cloudy to start your Monday with clearing through the afternoon. Let's show you how things look hour by hour. We're starting it off at 7 o'clock. Here's that line to the west. Notice how it lifts off in the northeasterly direction. We see the wet weather moving through portions of Sussex as well as Passaic up through Orange, Sullivan, Ulster, Duchess, and then by 10 o'clock, most of us are drying out. Just a few spotty showers are left overnight into the wee hours of your Monday morning. The clouds return as winds are gusting 30 miles per hour. And then we see here 7 a.m. The hint that maybe we'll get a little bit of wet weather during the daylight hours to start your Monday. And then as we move into the afternoon, skies begin to clear as winds are still cranking up to 25 miles per hour. Monday into Tuesday, a lot of sunshine will prevail. And then on Wednesday, we're tracking another storm system that brings us a Another red alert tonight 49 degrees. We've got some blustery leftovers happening right now through roughly 10 p.m. and then we'll dry out tonight. Winds will gust 30 even 40 miles per hour on the east end. Then tomorrow again early cloudy skies slim chance for a shower and into the afternoon. We'll see skies clearing. The winds will stay powerful gusting to 25 miles per hour and it'll be 53 tomorrow. Your extended forecast Tuesday is looking good. It's just cooler 48. Then on Wednesday it's a high of 59 with a red alert in play. We're expecting not just high winds, but heavy rain again in the forecast. After that Thursday, Friday, it's cooler in the 40s. Next weekend looking pristine for now. Temperatures in the low and mid 50s with a return to nothing but sunshine. Allie, back to you. All right. Thanks, Vanessa.